Yep. Fish on. Oh, good fish. Good fish. Oh, big mullet. Big mullet. I got two. <laughs> two mullet. Look at that one. G'day guys, welcome to another episode. Today I'm down at the surf beach and I've got the new LV Stealth 65 combo. We're just gonna flick it out with some baits and hopefully we can pick up some yellow eye mullet, Australian salmon, and see what else we can manage. So yeah, let's get the baits out. All right, bait of choice. I've got some squid strips. So this is a Paternoster rig with 20 pound um, fluorocarbon leader. I'm just using that to make the rig and the 1 0 hooks to cover all the species here. Top hook, I got a bit of chicken, and away we go. See what we can get. Any bites yet? Normally, it takes a fair bit of time for them to come yeah, in, yeah. but once they come in, you should get them. Yeah, the tide's going all over the place. Um, generally with a bit of tide the fish like because of the oxygen yeah. Um, but yeah once the fish come in then we should get them oh, oh. <laughs> already biting pretty good they're already here wind it slowly until it bites again and then when he bites a strike yep getting some bites now so watch my rod tip. Watch me strike, ready? It doesn't hook up all the time if they're smaller fish, but 90% of the time you should get them. Got it on. Oh, good fish. Good fish. Oh, big mullet. Big mullet. I got two. <laughs> Two mullet, look at that one. Woo! Look at that. Oh. I'll put it in your esky. How awesome is that, guys? Bloody hell. Well, have a go at that. I got two beautiful yellow eye mullet on the same line on the new Alvi setup. Absolutely stoked. Like, look at the size of that mullet. That is a big fish. Key element surf fishing is also burly. So, I've got some chopped up and shredded pilchards here. I'm just going to chuck them in the water and that should keep the fish around. Let's chuck that in there and that. Early, we just go in and out with all the waves and we should definitely bring the fish in and keep the fish around for a while. So we just click that, cast it right in the gutter, bang on the money and um, just wait for some fish to come around. What I got on? What is this? Another little salmon, bloody hell. Tiny. Ah, oh, these horse flies, they absolutely kill. Look at all the marks. Bloody everywhere. Anyways, let's get it back out there. in the zone there. What do I have here? Two. Two more mullet. <laughs> Got another two. Double yellow eye mullet off the surf. Bloody awesome. That is some really nice mullet there. 
There we go, guys. Another double yellow eye mullet right there. Awesome, awesome fish. Oh, one just came off, covered in sand, but really nice fish. In the zone. Just wind that slack. I can see fish in there already. I can already see some fish. I saw the um the flickers. Um, like, do you ever try like something big, like putting a uh, little, little salmon? Um, not really. More because the water's shallow here. Yeah. I have got a a draft for a shark off here, but it's just a rubbish shark. Yep. Fish on. Another mullet. Oh! <laughs> oh. Sometimes just whining and lifting your rod tip, that creates a sinker bouncing off the bottom. And what that does is um, it puffs sand up and that just gets the fish's attention if they're in the area. So I'm just gonna do that slowly, slow retrieve, pause, and keep doing that until you cover ground and, and find some fish in the area. Because these fish do swim around in and out of the gutters so when there's a school around and you do that, you should definitely get their attention. Oh yeah, already. Come on. Yep, got him on. Oh, nice fish. Look at that one. Oh. Shit, look at this guy. Out, look at that. <laughs> Good one. Look at the size of this one. Oh, <laughs> you just left it. Just <laughs> the... Jeez, oh, look at that. Massive. See how I'm talking about. So this is the yellow eye mullet. So yeah. compared to catching this on the top top end of Port Phillip Bay, yep. they'll be more of a yellow colour. Yep. But look at that, see wow, that silver? Fresh, nice, uh, fresh, healthy nice. Um, mullet there. So he just hooked perfectly. Nice. Awesome. awesome. Alrighty, bait it up. Get it back out there. Bloody hell, that was a close one. It feels good, but it gets more itchy. Oh yeah, I'm biting too. Yeah, yeah, that's a nice mullet. Jesus, I'm getting bites like right here. As soon as it hit the water. Oh my god, I got a fish right here. Oh, oh, it's a bloody toad fish. I've never ever got a toad fish off this surf beach. See how he's light in colour? Awesome. Well, not awesome, because I wasn't after that, but awesome to see this fish. What do we have here? It's going like a little salmon or something like that. Oh, there we go. 
bit bigger. So that's that size, that one, and he's bleeding, so we'll use that guy for bait. He can use a cube of salmon. Yeah, it, it'll stay on the hook a lot longer because the meat's firm, fresh. Oh, these flies. <laughs> flies are biting like crazy. And that is an awesome bait. Oh, hey, look what I got. Look what I got. Are you ready? Look at that. Look at that little crab. Look at that. Look how cool he is. Nice little sand crab. Chuck him back. Whoa. Chuck my bait back out. Yep, got a fish. Mullet. There we have another nice little yellow eye mullet. What was that on? That was on the uh, fresh salmon. Sweet. Yep, just got a fish on now. Right in front of that rock. What is it? It's a, uh, it's a mullet. Beautiful. Another nice mullet. Awesome. What I like about circle hooks most of the time, hooks them right in the corner of the mouth, but another awesome yellow eye mullet. Well, there we go, guys. That's our little session done off the surf beach. We got quite a few yellow eye mullet, which is really good. Um, we probably spent about two and a half hours here. So awesome stuff. We probably got about, I'd say 10 to 20, 20 fish. So that was pretty good. Testing out the new Alvi Stealth Combo side caster. So that's the first time really using it off the surf and um, pretty impressed with it. So if you enjoyed this episode, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, comment your thoughts, subscribe if you're new, just hit that subscribe button and I'll see you guys in the next one.